What is going on, everybody? Eddie Soundhead back once again here with Soundhead Entertainment. Back in Wreckfest once again here as we return to the Talladega Super Speedway for a couple of things that I think are going to be pretty fun here today. And we are going to give them a, a fair shot here. So, looks like we're starting at the back with this beautiful golden car here, driven by Dick Trickle at some point. But uh, we are here at Talladega with the pinball mod enabled. Not only for NASCAR Legends mod, we're going to start with that, but we got a couple of ideas for some things we're going to try out here in a little bit as well. But I want to get you a, a nice, classic, hopefully clean race. Who are we kidding? Uh, <laughs> Talladega, a clean race. Yeah, right. Especially with the pinball mod. But I want to start off with this, and then we'll move into some cool stuff that I think is going to be pretty fun and pretty fun to watch, hopefully. So let's jump right into this one. Let's see how it goes. Starting dead last, 24th. So we're going to have to come through them all to get a win today here at Talladega. We're underway, spinning the tires off, and that will begin our first race of the episode. We've got David Pearson up here driving that six car. Tim Richmond in the four. Earl Ross in a ten down there on the bottom. I'm in the wall already. How in the world did I manage to do that? The world may never know. I'm going to move down to the bottom here because that's where I feel the safest in this first corner, which is always just doomed to be destructive. And there they go already in the pinball mod has come into play and how are we going to get through this we're not that's the answer we're not going to get through this that is like driving through a tornado and i think we are beached i think we're done right there that's going to be a reset look at the carnage and the devastation oh david pearson came all the way from down low to come and punch me in the mouth and he paid the price for it he got launched across the track all kinds of cars laying across the bottom of the racetrack tony stewart has escaped away enormous margin humongous and enormous i guess I, I think i just kind of put those two words together accidentally but an absolutely enormous lead right now 22 seconds after all that we're mired back to ninth which is actually positions gained all things considered so not bad right there but not the ideal start to talladega you want to see ideally you'd get through all of that but we are on the move there the 98 car there jimmy johnson probably dragging the ground much like we are just listen to this thing yeah, that's not healthy. They shouldn't be doing that, but they are. It looks like Jimmy back there had the same problem we did. So we get by him with the greatest of ease. And now we're going to try and hope that something happens to those in front of us. Tony Stewart was in the lead. Something must have happened to him because now it's Benny Parsons, 23 seconds up front. And he's drastically losing time. Uh, oh, and then he rapidly gained a 10 seconds out of nowhere. So now I'm really confused as to what's happening. But all right. I'll accept it because you have to accept the unexpected in this game and a tide car is just going to pull right up across the track what are you doing that might not be the end of our trouble somebody else is pulling up against the track here we got drama up here in front of us 28 can't decide which way he wants to wreck us he decided a little bit too late though and that puts us in third that will put us in third we have a shot ladies and gentlemen because look at the times they are dropping rapidly for bp and morgan shepherd we are gaining all kinds of time right now within 15 seconds we are hunting down. Oh, a bad crash up there. I just saw a car getting launched across the screen. And the two car, he's going to pull right back up on the track. Are you insane, man? That's Phil Parsons. The worst Benny. Must be up here. Pull, is that him pulling out of the grass? Maybe, maybe that's Morgan Shepard. Who knows? Maybe that's a lap car, too. Maybe that's neither. That's going to be a collision. Oh, terrible hit. That could have been tragic. That four car just got absolutely mangled up against that inside wall. So it looks like this Wrangler car right up here might actually be Morgan Shepard. And then the yellow car up there that's about to get in an accident. Could be Benny Parsons. Don't you come back down. Oh, he almost did. He definitely thought about it. We got insane people driving across the track. The Wrangler car goes for a ride. This backstretch might as well be a minefield. It's insane. And that'll put us in a lead here as we're going to get by AJ Foyt. Put him a lap down. My goodness me, this has turned into a brawl here at Talladega on the backstretch. It literally is a minefield back there. I can't believe after all that, after that opening lap, we have found the lead. We have 88 health on the car. It's had better days, but relatively speaking, it actually looks pretty good. Missing a trunk is all that's really, really bad on it. We got one sitting in the middle of the road right here. Got another one sitting in the middle of the road right there. Oh, poor Jimmy Johnson finally finally met his, I think. Oh, it looks like he might have got hit again back there. I have no idea. We got the Michael Waltrip sitting on the inside, getting driven by Ricky Rudd there. 
and I think the backstretch is fairly clean at this point. Somebody's still driving across the track. Oh, another bad collision. Looked like a Richard Petty car and the six car came up into each other here, ducking, diving in between. Got a couple of them getting real bad. Oh, there's another hit in the middle of the corner. Not always, not usually where you see them. Oh, look out, look out. Oh my goodness. And that, I think, should hopefully do it. We might be home free now after a wild race at Talladega. How about it? Opening run, get the dub. That's, that's more of a rarity than anything at Talladega, I would say. All right, well, there you go. That's one way to start off your episode, get a win on the first try. Best lap, still over a minute, though, so not exactly blistering, but I think we did have the best time. Indeed, we did, so there you go. Well, what would be better than one win? How about, how about two? This is also just an excuse for me to go back through turn one and watch the destruction again, because that is literally too good sometimes, so that's what we're going to do here. Maybe we'll take the pinball mod off for a minute. Maybe we'll do a little reverse driving. What do you, what do you say to that? Because uh, I think with pinball mod, they won't even survive the first corner whether I'm driving backwards or not. But we'll see. We got to get through here first. See if we can get another dub. If not, we might get another death. And there is the big one breaking out right there. Oh, 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 oh. Can I get through this one? How are you going to get through that? Without much as a scratch. Still a lot of race left, but getting through that first corner without any kind of damage at all is nothing short of a miracle. Well, luck might be on our side today, judging by that. That was kind of incredible. Not gonna lie, I'm very surprised right now that I'm not dead, because usually uh, that first corner is chaotic. And we've done okay in it for the first couple of times we've tried thus far. So I'm kind of cheesing it on that inside lane right here. We got 224 cars. Neither one of them with the right driver. You'll have that sometimes. You'll have that every time, pretty much. But we are going to try and get up here to that lead as we crack the top five with the pass on the 24s. Oh, somebody just morphed up to the top of the track, down from the bottom. They're going to sit right in the center of the track, and that is going to be a hit right there. Yep, that looked pretty bad. Oh, well, Turn one was gonna strike, it just decided to do it a lap later, and I have lost the wheel on the rear end of the car. And we have pretty, well, man, we flattened this thing, look at us. My God, it didn't even seem that bad, but we are destroyed. Oh, we got a wheel sitting up right here, can I even drive this thing? No, this thing ain't going anywhere. I'm flooring it right now, this thing is not going anywhere. All right, well, that, uh, oh, Cole just got owned again. Let's see here. I think that'll probably do it for this round. We say we restart it and do it again. And get ready for the turn one destruction up here. It's gonna be bad. It always is bad. I'll try the high side this time. Let's see if I can drive around some people. Oh, I just got hit hard. Right in the rear end. Watch out a couple. Yeah, yeah, it's Jimmy Johnson. I think I just killed Jimmy Johnson. I hit him right in the head. Pull this thing out there. The destruction laid across the track. Tires. Falling across the track. Oh, Jimmy's alive. He's good. He's okay. He's got a couple of scratches is all. Now, Fort Car, don't you pull up on me, Fort Car. Thank you. Oh, what is happening to the Fort Car? He's just rolling over. Oh, my God. All right. This might be our final run through turn one here. And oh, my God. How? How are you going to survive that? We're getting knocked around a little bit here. Save it. Hold on to it. Couldn't do it. Got hit in the face right there. <laughs> Actually, once again, came out. Oh, the 24 doing a backflip back there. Tragic. Here, I'm going to aim for this green car right here. Come here. Come here. Oh, I'm, wow. How are you going to miss? How are you going to miss, though? Here, let's turn this thing around then. I'm, I'm not satisfied with that. Turn it around here. We're going to hit somebody head on. Come here. You won't. Oh, my God. I think my engine just flew out of the car. I literally think I just saw the engine go flying in the opposite direction of us. Back it up. Back it up. Come on. Somebody hit me there. Oh, the 15 is going head over here. It's always going to come straight for us. Come on. Hit me. You are useless. Come on. Somebody hit me. This car will not move. This car will not do anything. Come on. I am mashing the gas here. The car is destroyed. And uh, I think we might be due. Come on, you can do it. You can do it. Look at the steering wheel in there, even. 
That thing is mangled. Oh, and there's cars just flying across the screen back there. I think this one might be a lost cause. I'm not going to sit here all day. So I think that's enough turn one calamity for the regular way. I think we're going to go back out, take off uh, pinball mod, and then let's do a little backwards running. What do you say? Well, we have got something quite interesting in store here. This has been something that's been absolutely begged uh, for, for quite some time now. And I've tried it out a couple of times to minimal success, and I think you're about to see why, but I figured I'd at least give it another shot, because it has been a while. So let's try it. School buses at Talladega. Oh boy. Now, these things aren't exactly fast, and they aren't exactly maneuverable. They don't exactly get to high speeds. There's a lot of things wrong with, with racing school buses at Talladega. Um, and being in the middle of the both lines is not exactly something I want to be doing either. So I'm going to like try and work over Benny here to try and get his spot. Sorry, Benny. Had to be done. Because I think you're going to want to make a little bit of avoidance up top if you can help it. Because the first corner isn't just carnage when the NASCAR legends show up. Usually happens when the buses show up too, and there they go, except they're going right where I want to be, which is a problem. Can I sneak around the outside? And there is a massive bus accident at Talladega. Well, there you have it. There you have it right there. So, not sure if we're gaining or losing time or what the deal is here, but we're going to go for it. Just got to keep it low now. Not much else you could do. It's kind of boring, which is why I've never really done it before. As you guys can see, it's kind of after the first corner. It's just just kind of this. So. Yeah. And that will pretty much conclude our little experiment here at Talladega with the school buses racing each other. Um, I do have one more idea for a school bus race, and that is maybe to go slap the pinball mod back on and see how it goes. Let's do that just for scientific purposes. All right, we've got pinball mod enabled now. This is going to get rather interesting, I guarantee it. Even uh, even the staging up here is going to get pretty interesting. So I'm going to just get out of the way. I'm going to try to get as far away from the line up here as I possibly can. Because these some of these cars are going to come together. And it's not going to be pretty when they do. So, yeah. Yikes. Big yikes is going to be what we're going to see down here in turn one. I'd rather be up on the high side, to be honest with you. But we've been damned to the inside lane this time. So, just cross your fingers and hope for the best. That's about all we can do right now. Things are going to get rather interesting right about now. Yep, and there it is. Wow. Yep. That one, uh, that one hit a little bit sooner than I anticipated it hitting us, and somebody's gone for an absolutely amazing tumble barrel roll over there. And they're wrecking further into the corner where I can't see them now, so... Uh, bad times. Bad times. Yep. I think that's going to be a restart. Okay, so, attempt number one. Abysmal failure. Attempt number two, can I get up to the top without causing too much drama? With David Pearson, uh, I did it. Okay, oh, and, oh, yep, that uh, that's unfortunate. But we're okay, and that's all that matters. Get that down in front of the red bus here. Just for now, because I'm going to make a break for this top side here. Let's go for it. It's going to get rather interesting here once again, just shortly. These buses are so slow, topping out at 80 miles an hour. I wish there was a mod to make the buses faster. That would be a nice mod to have. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. They're actually, I was going to say, they're kind of behaving themselves, but that didn't last long, did it? Can I fly underneath the white bus? No, I cannot. And that, uh, that'll do it. That'll do it. And, uh... Somehow didn't take any damage, yet we got hit. So I don't understand that one at all, but... Okay. Seems legit. 
Let's see, just riding around down here. Oh, not a better bad wreck, bad wreck up here ahead of us. Oh, don't you come get me. Oh, you tried, dude. You definitely tried. Well, that's definitely interesting. We're gonna get a nice run here. Can I get to get the third here? Why? 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 What was the point of that? That was an assault. That was a murder. Oh my god, I can't believe that just happened. Why? I found Tanya Harding, the lady that she she tried to like break her knees that one time or whatever it was. I'm just gonna park it right here. And I'm gonna wait for somebody to come kill me. Actually, you know what? No, I'm not. I'm gonna start turning it this way. Oh wow. Everybody's beating me to the punch here. I want somebody to hit me head on. Oh, here we go. This is gonna be good. This is gonna be good right here. Oh. 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 That looked like it hurt. A lot. Well, here, let's just drive backwards. Why not? This is just going to devolve into a mess at this point. This is the point where the, the insanity comes out and it all just kind of goes down here. Here, we got one coming at us head on. That's a spinner Rooney if I've ever seen one. Camera's going crazy on me. Let's see. What can this do right here? Double trouble. We're flying. We're flipping. We're rolling. We're tumbling. And over and on the roof. Oh, and he's... Oh, I was going to say he sucked the landing. And he sticks the landing a little bit later. There you go. Well, I'm going to get hit one more time. If it doesn't kill me, then I'm just going to restart. Or maybe we'll jump into something else. Because I feel like we've gotten all we can out of this one. That's going to take a good bit of health away from me, but not nearly enough. Give a shot to the white bus right there. Ah, what do you say? We're only 44 health away. Let's just finish ourselves off. We got floating tire tracks. Anybody else see that? That's pretty neat. Don't see that every day. Now, let's see. Somebody's getting like pushed along here. This red bus is dead, and I think there's a blue bus is giving him a shove. And this is gonna be another bad wreck right here. Yep. Could see that coming from a mile away. There's one coming at full speed down the road here. No, don't you pull back up. You are an idiot. Here we go. There we go. Nice shot right there. Oh. There you go. And there it is. All right. Mission accomplished. Okay, so that uh, that was fun. Now you guys kind of see why school buses at Talladega doesn't really work. I do have an idea for a school bus at Talladega, so let's go ahead and jump into that. Well, here we are, ladies and gentlemen, back at Talladega. <laughs> and we are here in the yellow school bus with the NASCAR Legends. And we are not going to race these NASCAR Legends because I think it would uh, would be pretty much a waste of our time and yours. I think we had any kind of chance up against these uh these stock cars but hopefully by now you see where i'm going with this i have a much better plan all right looks like the nascar legends are coming out of turn four right now we're gonna meet them right in the middle of uh, a little ways down the back stretch here we go oh my god oh a terrible crash is broken out here at Talladega, the school bus causing calamity. That was a brutal impact. We'll have to go look at that in the replay in a little bit. But I still see some survivors over here. I got one coming at me full speed. Come on, you don't stand a chance. Oh, God, that was brutal. Come on, I still see more of Come on, he ain't got nothing for me. You, oh, maybe you do, actually. <laughs> maybe you do. Oh, one of them's going to hit me afterwards, too. Yep. Oh, brutalized. Absolutely brutalized. Well, we got to look at that in the replay mode, because that was just insane. All right, here comes the bus. I can hear the NASCAR legends coming as well, and that's just a hellacious head-on impact with the school buses and a ton of them pile in behind there. Just a terrible crash. And then we turn around and get a little bit more. Let's look at that from a little bit different angle here. All right, we got the free camera going here. We got the school bus coming by. We got the NASCAR legends coming in hot. Let's see them meet. Yep, that was pretty brutal. That was incredibly brutal. Let's see, and then we weren't even done yet. We come in it for a little bit more.
Oh, brutal. And then we still weren't done. And this, I think, is the one that takes us out. Takes the engine out of us and everything. And then a couple more of them are going to come through at the end. And that will reset the replay right there. But wow. Major contact. Major carnage. Right there. And we're going to do it again. Okay, I wonder if we're going to meet at the back stretch again. I figured we'd do this three times. We've already done it once. So this is attempt number two right here. We're gonna come at him right here and get a bunch of them. Let's go. Oh, destroyed, and that is a massive crash. The 28 is flying all way up in the air. Oh, and we got Richard Petty out of the park. My, oh my, that is absolute devastation. And we got another one coming. You thought you were lucky. You thought you got away. You were wrong. You didn't have a chance. You had never had a chance. All right, so that was ludicrous once again, but we're still rolling. Three wheels on the wagon. The school kids, they've, uh, they've all died at the front, it looks like. If you're sitting in the back, you probably just got the world's worst concussion and whiplash ever. But they're coming back at me again, and that will be their demise. And there it is. Oh my god. Alright, let's break out the replay and let's go ahead and look at that one again. Alright, so here comes the bus. Here come the NASCAR legends. For the major impact there, the 30 car way up in the air, the 28 gets launched. About even with the top of the fence up there and they're rolling, they're flipping, they're bouncing. And just having a real bad time out there. And look at the front end of the bus. Absolutely mashed in. And then, of course, some poor soul comes through thinking he's going to just be able to sneak on by, and alas, he does not. Old The old 11 car did not stand a chance right there, and that's where we lose a wheel. And then we fast forward a little bit. We'll see some more. So then they come at us. We're going to clip the first one, it looks like. Yep, clip the 24 and absolutely destroy. What was that, the 98 car? Couldn't even tell who it was, but got a couple of them right there. And that knocks both front wheels off the... The front end of the bus and then that resets the replay so those were two good attempts what do you say we take one more and then we'll move on to something a little bit different all right for our final backwards bus attempt let's see how it goes they're already wrecking pretty hard down there and that's a head-on that is a terrible set of head-on hits oh they're just piling it this is the worst one yet oh somebody flew under me oh my god we landed on the wheels dude what a g what a beast. Well, you're not going to get away from me that easily, are you? Come on. You ain't got nothing. Oh, we're going to die right here. Two health. This one's going to come at us, and that'll do it. Man, they are just getting launched. That two car went flying. Oh, my goodness. That was the best one we did yet. Let's go ahead and look at the replay. So here we go for our final attempt. The bus absolutely dominating these, these NASCAR legends as they just keep coming. And they don't stop coming. And uh, that 30 car kind of like halfway flew underneath us, which was pretty amazing. We landed on the wheels. We just immediately throw it in gear and come pick up a couple extra ones. And that will pretty much write us off. A couple extra ones come in right here at the end. The two car just goes flying. And that was our demise as we take out a bunch of them and even get another extra, extra shot to that 15 car right at the end there. So there you go. That was going backwards with the school bus. That's something I've wanted to do for a little while now finally got to try it out i have one more idea for another special vehicle here at talladega and i think that's how we'll wrap things up let's go ahead and jump into that right now all right we're back with the lawnmowers here at talladega let's give this a shot here let's see how this goes it's gonna be rather interesting that much is for sure just racing on stock and let's see how it goes we're getting some pretty decent speed though maxing out at 40 miles an hour so there you have it. This is not the most entertaining race I think we're ever going to see. But uh, it is at least legit. And uh, we know that these drivers are sensitive. If they if they as much as touch the ground, they are going to be turned into minced meat. And I am rubbing up with Bobby Labonte right now. So let's see. This is going to be funny, I think, when we get down to turn one this time. Whenever we eventually get there, I made this a two-lap race. If I was smart, I probably would have made it a one-lap shootout. 
Those two laps around here is going to take us about a half an hour at this rate. This is unbelievably slow. But I guess that's what we get for taking a lawnmower to a super speedway. <laughs> Maybe not our brightest idea ever. But it's something that the fans have been asking for for a while, so why not give it a shot here? Let's see. I'm just going to ride it low. Oh, somebody did something weird right there. Oh, we got ones coming up across the nose of each other. Are they not even going to wreck? Nobody even crashed in turn one. This is a... Oh, wait a minute. Might have spoke too soon there. Bobby Labonte's going around. Oh, no! That scared me so bad. I can't even explain to you how much I that scared me right now. That literally scared me. Oh, we got one loosened out a little bit. Lost control a little bit. Nobody really doing anything too crazy, though. Everybody's kind of just minding their business. And I think everybody's going so slow, they don't really have a choice. I'm going to stick with it, though, just in case. Oh, we might have some contact up ahead of us here. Got a couple of them fighting. Oh, they're going down low. And there's a death. Oh, I think the driver just went through the world. There's another one over here just laying on the ground. You poor sap. You just lay there and you recover, but it's all right. It'll be over soon. Okay. So, first couple of casualties of the Talladega Lawnmower race. Oh, no. There it is. That guy just, he just decided that it was my time to die, basically, is what happened right there. So, I don't know about you guys, but that's like the most boring thing I think I've, I've done ever in Wreckfest, like ever, ever. So thanks to that guy killing me, I don't have to go through the rest of that lap. I have an idea, let's get on with it. Well, this ought to be good, don't you think? I'm gonna try and get to the inside as fast as I can right here without getting hit. And we are just gonna try it here. We'll do a couple attempts at this. I did add in a different mod. I actually added in a mod called the Lawnmower Showroom model that uh, I guess in theory would make the lawnmower faster. However, unfortunately it does not make the other lawnmowers faster, just ours. So, worth a shot. Unfortunately it wouldn't have made the race we tried a little bit earlier any better, but uh, it will at least make this attempt a little bit more worth trying. It will actually hopefully meet up with the other cars on the backstretch, as a couple of them have already died, it would seem, as Dale Jr. has met his maker, uh, according to our leaderboard right there. And we are indeed going to meet with them, kind of headed into the corner here. So let's see how this goes. We're probably going to get owned right here. That, uh, that actually went shockingly well. I'm amazed that we're still alive, but there's still many chances we have to not be alive. So let's go ahead and just, let's just end it right here. And that'll probably do it. That definitely did it. Okay. Wow. I am really shocked that that first attempt didn't really get it done. But, that's why we give ourselves three attempts at this. Let's do it again. All right. This is going to be a much better meat area. This is going to hurt, though. Yep, and there it is. Absolutely destroyed, demolished, and everything in between. That was unbelievable. And I think my guy is getting run over as we speak. That one we're going to have to look at in a replay. All right, here we go. Here comes the lawnmower. Here comes the NASCAR legends. And my goodness. Oh, we got hit by Jeff Gordon. Our guy's flying up in the air. Oh, he got nailed by a car. And then our big one causes back there, but we were already dead, so it cuts off the replay, unfortunately. But whoa, what a way to go right there. Oof. Let's take one more shot at it. Okay, coming up for our final attempt here. Gonna try to meet them head on. Got some of them wrecking in the back again, but this is gonna be it. Oh, what a hit. Oh, our poor driver. I think he might be still up there getting hit. I don't even know. Oh, that caused a huge one. We come to a rest in turn three. All right, well, we got to go ahead and look at that replay, obviously. That might have been our best one yet, though. Perfect, perfect for our final attempt. All right, coming in hot. NASCAR Legends coming opposite. Oh, we just get absolutely destroyed by the Skull Bandit there, and a huge wreck breaks out. And it looks like uh, this one's probably going to cut off pretty early since we died so fast yet, but... Man, just got absolutely abused right there. That that was tragic, though. So hopefully you guys enjoyed that video. If you did, be sure to hit that like button. That helps me out a lot when you guys do that. 
I appreciate it when you do. So thank you very much for that. And make sure to subscribe to uh, if you haven't already. And that'll pretty much do it. So uh, again, leave your comments down below for suggestions, future RecFest videos, future anything videos here on the channel. And uh, that'll do it for me. So thank you again, guys, for watching. I'll see you in the next one. Peace.